Hello and welcome to Fatherly Wisdom. Today I'm going to show you how to make a candle from your old grease can that you got sitting in your kitchen. I always save the grease because I don't like to pour it down the drain because it's bad for the plumbing. So take that grease, throw it in a pot, let it melt. Just put it on low to medium heat. And wait for that to become completely liquid. Now while we're watching this melt, if you want to leave me a comment, let me know if you plan on trying this at home. I'd appreciate it. If you want to slap that like button, that'd be great too. Once it's complete liquid, you need to figure out a way to strain it. So you can run it through a strainer, or what I chose to do is I made sure it was completely melted down, and then I poured it into a big bowl of water, because the solids will settle to the bottom, and the grease will ride to the top. This is a pretty easy process. It's probably not as good as if I would have strained it a couple times or run it through something like a coffee filter or cheesecloth, but it worked good enough for me. And then once that's all settled, you want to put that somewhere cool, like outside or in your refrigerator or freezer, so that, that grease will become hard, waxy, and white. That way you can separate it from the water again. Break those chunks up and throw them back into your pot on medium to low heat again. And then once it's liquid, you want to go ahead and set up a container with a wick in it. I tried a couple different methods of homemade wicks and I wasn't really pleased with the outcome. I would suggest getting a commercial wick. It'll stand up better than most of the homemade versions. And you also need to figure out a way to get it to stand up. You can either prop it up or you can use some different solutions to make it stand up straight. Once that is allowed to settle and get hard again, you have a candle that you can light and enjoy. Thanks for watching. See you next time.